I've been dreaming on in my head like I've seen it A life worth living is a life with meaning I'll do what I love till my heart stops beating I'm feeding this demon Got a taste, can't erase bitterness in my face Work a job every day till your dreams fade away Like a card, never change, play the game that we say I need a break Hi everyone, I'm glad you're here. Thank you once again for joining me this evening. Today is June 28th, 2022, and it's Tuesday. And we got a live view of the camera there at Yellowstone. Oh, they just moved it. Um, a reminder, if you guys go to the park, stay away from the buffalo. There was a goring again there at the park. I think it was yesterday. Let me show you some images, the video is on Reddit and it's also available on YouTube. And these are stills from that video. Uh, there was uh, three, maybe four adults and one child who evidently was four years old and they got way too close to this bison. Uh, it charged them. Uh, they left the child behind. The child started running and this man went to rescue the child. He grabbed the child and both of them got tossed up in the air by the buffalo. Kind of looks like he grabbed it between the horns and the head. There's the child dangling. And there they are after the buffalo dropped them, laying on the ground. They both got up, the four-year-old and the adult man, and just ran like the dickens. Luckily, from what I've been told, they only had minor injuries. So stay away from the buffalo. More people are evidently killed by buffalo than by the grizzly bears or the other bears there at the park. USGS is only reporting four earthquakes so far for the last 24 hours. There has been more. And the largest, they said, was a 2.0, but it was actually a 2.5. Oh, excuse me, a 2.45. Uh, there's its uh, spectrogram. There's its seismic signature. Here we have the stream view. You can see here at the bottom, this is the monitor for Maple Creek, and there's been more. The one in the middle um, is for Holmes Hill, and the one at the top is the borehole 207. You can see we got one here that lines up across all three. That earthquake is not being reported. That comes in as a magnitude 1.85. Let me bring it down here so you can see it. Yeah, I really shortened up the uh, seismic signature. And there's a spectrogram. I probably should have made it a little bit longer. But it is not being reported. Magnitude 1.85. We have another one here at um, 2015 not being reported. And it's a small one. It comes in as a magnitude 1.85 zero. Two more at 1247 and oh probably about five seconds and 1247 and 25 seconds not being reported. The first one comes in as a magnitude 1.35 and we'll take a look at the spectrograms and the second one comes in as a magnitude 1.54. Fairly deep it looks like. This next one right there at 501 they're saying is a magnitude 0 0.9 but i don't know they really screwed up on that one it comes in as a magnitude 2.12 and i'll show its signature there it is the monitor for the borehole there at yellowstone lake now this is madison river you can see we got a lot of them marked in red let's go to the seismic signature and these are tectonic in movement seeing how they're round also and they have the sharp points yeah there's been a lot of them going on today yeah the activity is continuing there at Yellowstone yep oh it went too small on me okay let's go over here there you go yep tectonic and this is what it was showing when I pulled the files yeah, let's bring it down a little bit. We'll go to the spectrogram. Yeah, deep, deep, real deep. So I downloaded three different monitors. I'm going to go to the tilt meters because look at Holmes Hill. 
Yeah, it looks like uh, something definitely happened there. Yeah, the ground went a little goofy. Here we have the tilt for the borehole for Madison River. This is for the last seven days. Yeah, it's rising. It's going up. And there's the disc showing uh, the direction that it's rising. And then we got the last 30 days. Yep, definitely going up. The tilt meters for Yellowstone Lake are not working. Same with the canyon. They're not working. Panther, which is up north by uh, the uh, Mammoth Vault, not working. Grant is working. Um, as you know, the lake is tipping. So it makes sense that it would show that it's going down. And here's all the earthquakes. Yeah, yeah, it's been a rocking and a rolling. So the only thing really dependable we have is the borehole for Madison River. And that's where all the earthquakes have been occurring. And that's where the unzipping of Yellowstone would probably start. And we'll go down to the last 30 days. Yep. Yeah. So this video will be short and sweet. Yeah, look at all the hot steam coming off of the pool there. If you have any thoughts or questions or comments, please put it down below. Stay away from the buffalo. Please stay safe. And I will talk to you later. God bless you. Bye.